It's your, your time. You Am can feel right? it? Yeah, you can. I'm sorry. It. I feel that you... <laughs> is, it, is it something that you, uh, you do easy answering questions, you know, to journalists? Because with, with your job, you have to do that a lot, right? Right. Um, you know what? I'm not the best at doing that. I, I like to do my thing and act and dance on stage, but I know it goes along with what, you know... What's worse, to talk about yourself or to, to, to reply to the same questions all the time? I don't mind replying. If it's about the movie, I don't mind. It's probably personal questions mm. that really perturb me. Mm -hmm. so tell us about the French audience. I mean, do, do you feel the differences between, uh, of course, you have fans all over the world, uh, can, but can you sense, can you feel, you know, oh, you know, in France, they, they like this and they, they, do you feel differences between audiences? Yeah, definitely. I think the, the fans overseas are a lot more, um, they get more excited about things, which is nice. I oh. like that, yeah. So you would you, would you say the French fans are more excited than mm -hmm. Americans? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. What do you like about French? French. Well, the fans? food's really good. Mm. I can deal with the food, the food and um, um, the accents. I like the accents. They're very nice. Let's talk about the movie again. I mean, give, give, to tell me. I try to remember the, the, your first emotion when you watch a movie. You, you told me that you're looking up to uh, people like Julia Roberts. Uh, do you remember? You know, watching a movie, you have. You had this emotion. You were watching a scene. What would be? What what kind of scene? Can, can you remember? You know what? My favorite scene is probably the scene where she's in the bathtub in Pretty Woman, and she's sitting there and she's just singing and having a good time. I like that. I think that's cool. Uh -huh. When you saw that scene, you said, you said prior to yourself, you know, one day I'd like to be like Julia Roberts. I would like that. Yes. Yeah. I will try. Does it mean that you wanted to be uh, an actress before mm -hmm. yeah. and, and more than a singer? No, I wanted no. to be a singer first, but then um, the acting thing came along. and I've, I've always had it in the back of my head that I wanted to be an actress, definitely. So now you had this experience with Crossroads. Mm -hmm. what, what is the best and the worst about this, this new job? You know, honestly, there was nothing really bad about it. No, there's nothing worst about it at all. I mean, the whole thing was, whole experience was amazing. It was really, really cool. If you have to compare it with uh, uh, with singing, um, do you see? Uh, I mean, th does it help you to, to be? You know, a it's just a diff It's just another form of expressing yourself in a different way. You know, just playing a character, definitely. Did you do something uh, special in preparation? Watch other Maya Carey in, in Glitter or Madonna in, in other movies? You know, you wanted to. Did I do anything in preparation? Yeah. Actually, I had like a week of rehearsal with an acting coach before I started filming. And did you pick, uh, did you learn anything about acting that you didn't think, you know? You... No, I mean, honestly, I just, you know, I thought, I, I found out that it was a lot more freer than what I thought. Like you can do one line in so many different ways and that's so much fun, you know, it's cool. Mm -hmm. uh, it was fun every day on the, during the shooting of course. Yeah, I had the girls with me and we just, we had a great time, you know, it was awesome. Can you tell me anything unusual that happened uh, during the, the shooting? Anything unusual that happened? Uh, I'm trying to think. Um, well, there's a lot of things that happened. Uh, the, the funnest thing that happened was probably the night where me and the girls, we all were jumping on the bed and we were really de deliriously tired. And they got all this crazy stuff on um, film. I think they put it at the very end of the movie, but it was cool. It was a lot of fun. Have you, you talk about you talk a, a lot about your, your family, your mother, so mm -hmm. I assume she's very important uh, uh, for you. Uh, did you show the movie to, to some special... Uh, did you have a, a special screening for, for uh, your family, for instance? I mean, you, because you wanted to... Actually, the first screening was in New Orleans, my hometown. Oh. Yeah, and my, all my family, we got to go there. It was nice. What kind of feedback did you get from, from your, uh, the people you, you're close to? It was awesome. It was amazing. It was very cool. Uh -huh. They were very happy for me. Okay. If, if there is one thing we can say about uh, Britney Spears through this movie, uh, you know, you said uh, a few minutes ago that uh, it's a different story. It's not the story of your life. But if there is one thing, maybe this song, That Yellow Woman, uh, what, what would be, you know, the line or the scene that uh, you feel you're very uh, close to? Lucy? Um, probably the part where she gets on stage and she starts to sing the karaoke song 
I think a little bit of me came out, definitely. This happened to you? Huh? The same scene happened to you in, in your life? You had... You were in no, scene. no, I'm just saying that's the one thing that I can kind of relate to. But I, as far as something, as far as the movie goes and me relating to something, um, probably just the whole idea of Lucy leaving her hometown and going somewhere to pursue her dreams, I, I can relate to that. This happened to you, you left Louisiana, mm -hmm. of course, to go yeah. to LA. Mm -hmm. In a car with some friends or... No, not like, yeah, not like that. <laughs> not okay. like that. All right. Do you speak some French? No. No. All right. I say merci anyway in French. Okay. <laughs> Thank you.